Nice. So outside of DJing, do you have any hobbies or things that you're interested in? Um, I'm also, and not many people know about this, but I am a uh, personal trainer. Nice. I'm certified Same personal shape, certified personal, personal trainer. I am a RKC certified um, kettlebell instructor, which, look it up. RKC, look it up. Yeah, tell um, me a little bit about that. That basically, it's, it's pretty much the worldwide um, recognized certification for doing kettlebells. And... Um, Kettlebells, I mean, everyone thinks it's new, but they've been around for hundreds of years. They're, they're like Russian. Um, Russian armies would train with these for their fitness. Oh, okay. And it's, it's like the ultimate in hardcore. I mean, it's basically a little a, a cannonball uh -huh. with a handle. That's it. But, you know, they range anywhere from 9 to 106 pounds or, or bigger. And um, it's, it's really starting to like take off in this country. I'm, I've heard about now. it recently. Well, we'll have to yeah. I'll put you to a workout and... and you know, after this is over. I'm scared, but I'll, I'll be scared. I'm open I'm to it. I'm open to it. Okay. It seems like it'd be a challenge. It, it definitely is a challenge, but it's totally like worth it. Like it's it's like no other workout you're gonna. You're not gonna be sitting, you know, on a chair at the bench doing curls or or anything. Not there's anything wrong with that. But but it is something different. It probably works your body out in a different way. It's a way. complete body workout. I mean, it's a lot of core strength and just overall body strength. Like almost everything you're gonna be doing with it. Mm -hmm uses your entire body. A lot of power coming from your hips, your back, you know, and it's it's really starting to take off a lot of, um, you know, professional like, That's what I was going to say. That's what I've heard. A lot of professional um, people that play sports and yeah, things definitely. like that. Yeah, definitely. A really... lot of athletes. I mean, I know for a fact, like the, the 49ers and, and a few of the other teams, they have like full full kettlebell setups and they have like professional instructors come that's and work with I've them. And, and actually like met a, a, a lady on Valentine's Day and her husband, that's what he did. He would go out and work with a professional, yeah. certain. And um, I mean, it's like I'm so much more stronger, just body force. You know, forget mm -hmm. about like what I can bench press or whatever, but just the strength, the body strength. strength itself, like your functional strength right. that your body needs in everyday life is just a lot more right now. Okay, interesting. It's, yeah. learn, so, it's always good to learn about different, you know. And areas. I, I've started like my own brand of of them, so it's you know I'm pushing them even more, and it, it kind of gives credibility to the brand to be. Like okay, you're fully certified, so not only do you sell them, but you're you're qualified enough to you teach. You have both because, things yeah. to offer. I mean, you'll go to like a sporting goods store and, and be sold something, but not yeah, you know necessarily. Not. You don't know what you're doing with it, or right. they they can't really explain it to you either. But you know, I like to practice what I preach. Yeah, so. exactly. Okay, so back to the music. Is there any certain type of music that is your favorite thing to to play? Do you have a? Or, um, you know, I actually like to just go into a place, figure them out, and mm -hmm. do whatever. Like, I don't, I don't like to be, you know, given a limit of right. what I can and can't play. Just kind of give me a basic guideline of what you want to be happening, mm -hmm. and just let me take it from there. I mean, you know, we, for the most part, have enough experience to be able to read a crowd, right? give them what they want, keep them excited, mm -hmm. and, you know, throw a couple of shockers at them now and then, so. Yeah. Do you have a certain favorite aspect of DJing, um, the music itself spinning, uh, seeing the crowd react to the music, um, traveling, is there some um, one probably favorite all thing? Of or well, all I mean, you know what, it's, it's the ultimate in power, you know, just grabbing the, the, the crowd by their balls and... Having that control. Yeah, exactly. Right. You know, you, you think, I'm up here on the stage, but even the guy in the little corner mm -hmm. can hear what's what's happening from right. my hands, you know, the, the people outside smoking, like they can still hear yeah. what I'm doing, you know, no matter where you are in the building, mm -hmm. you're listening to me. Just having a, having that captive audience. Yeah, you know? definitely, I can imagine. Is there anything that you want to tell the people that listen to the station or that go to the parties that you DJ at or bands? Keep on listening, shake well, and listen often. There you go. All right. Well, thank you. It was a pleasure speaking with you today. You too. Get your sweats on. Let's... All right, we're going to go out and, and do it. I'm going to strong. <laughs> All right, well, for more information, go to knoxlifestyle.com.